Hello everyone. In this lesson, let's talk about features in Python. As we know, Python is powerful middle layer programming language. So in Python, we have a lot of features available, but out of that, some important features are there in Python because how Python is becoming more popular. So based on these features, we can talk about. So let's discuss about few features here. So first feature we have is simple. See, Python is very simple and small programming language. Reading a Python program is like almost reading English book. While reading, how we can feel same, we can feel it while writing Python code also. The next feature we have, easy to learn. A Python program is clearly defined and easily readable. The structure of the program is very, very simple. So we have few syntaxes which is very easy. So it will use few keywords in English for Python syntax. Almost it, it feel like reading English and it will use only few keywords in whole program. So we'll show you some code later, but it is easy to capture and easy to remember also. This makes easy for just anyone to pick up the language as their career. So the people who are interested to go for programming language, easy to learn feature can help the students or the people who are learning Python programming language. Then we have a feature like free and open source. Python is an example of open source software. That means, we don't need to pay for a license. So it's a free and open source language. Therefore, anyone can freely distribute it and anyone can read source code also and anyone can edit and anyone can write new programs. That means open source means who are writing any feature or any logic, then you can able to read that logic also. That means it's an open source programming language. Then we have another feature. It's very important feature that is high level language. When we are writing a Python program, then we don't need to worry about memory management. That means Python will have PVM, like how we have JVM, Java virtual machine. We have PVM. Python virtual mission. That means when you are writing a Python program, then it will compilation will be done automatically. That means dynamically compilation is there through Python interpreter. That means you don't need to specify the memory for any value. It will take automatically. That means Python is dynamically typed language. Okay. So that's why Python will have more importance in memory management automatically. So this, this feature will help for the developers or programmers to understand very quickly. And then we have interactive feature. Programs in Python will work in interactive mode. So interactive mode means it's applicable for all the things, okay? For testing and debugging of whatever that. So that means same code you can use in developer environment, debugging environment, in production environment. That means more interact. So it will be applicable for all the tools also. The same code you can copy everywhere. So that in for if you want to do the testing or debugging, then we can do through interactive feature. So that means Python is interactive programming language. Then we have another important 
feature that is portable python is portable language and hence and hence programming language behave it will it will act as a same program for any software for example we have we are using uh, like you can say uh, windows windows xp whatever the operating system or like say, apple or we will use ios right so we will use anywhere the programming code is same that means you can copy and paste it so it will work that means python will have portable feature so or you can say you can go for linux windows solaris whatever that whatever the operating system the python can can be useful without any modifications so that's why python is more booming right now then object oriented so object oriented python supports object oriented language that means while object oriented technique that encapsulate the data and functionality with objects that means when you are building a logic then the implementation it will not show exactly what you have developed that means it will hide the implementation process that means it will be more secure so how java is there same thing python also object oriented programming so python is powerful still a simple programming language for implementing oops concepts and easily with compared to other languages compared to other programming language like c c++ java then oops concepts are very clear and straight forward in python programming language in building the requirement for logics and then we have dynamic language as we discussed python is dynamically typed language python executes dynamically the program that means if you have 10 lines of code after 10 lines of code you need to compile the code in java but in python it will take care of everything in the first line itself once the first line is clear then it will go for second line so while typing your code then dynamically it will check whether the code is getting error or not that means dynamically typed language so it is very very important and flexible feature in python and then we have extensive libraries also available so python consists of huge number of libraries right now we have more than 3 lakhs libraries are available later it will increase so we can easily portable across the different platforms that means you don't need to develop any logic just you can understand the requirement and pick perfect library or suitable library from python and build a logic that means you are not going to build any logic by specifying many lines for example in java if you want to get five value like that's 3.14 something else in java you have to use at least 8 to 9 8 to 10 lines the same thing applicable in python it's one or two lines we can apply so that means six lines of code and then the logic is taking some time to for the developer to build a logic so we can able to solve the issue or complex issue within the fraction of seconds using python that's why so it will act as the same like java but it is open source lengthy of code is not applicable in python we can do a lot we can write a logic within the less code using less code only and then we have another feature that is robust and secure so python is more secure language now python 3 has security updates so previously python 2 they are using in every company using python 2 now they are migrating python 2 to python 3 because security updates are not working so that's why they are migrated into python 3 because it has a great community support for example if you are working in a project you don't know anything to how to write a code then you need to discuss with the community okay python 2 before that we don't have any community now so python 3 will have great community support and it will accept security of 
updates also that is more secure in information technology this python programming language so we have many features but it will help so these are the future features will be helpful to understand clearly what python programming language how it is getting boom okay so thank you very much we'll see you in the next live with a new concept